so in this video you are going to learn how to create um motion capture with um quick magic ai like what you can see on your screen right now but before we continue don't forget to click on the subscribe button and also on the notification bell to get more um videos so um quick magic so this quick magic you can see it here quick magic.ai you can find the link in the um description box you get all my bio so um next thing we are going to do is to launch it so make sure you open an account in um i'll be on quick magic ai or quick magic dot ai so this is what you see there, there is a free version and there is also um a premium version so uh, so this is what you will see and um select upload because this is where we are going to upload the video we want to use for the motion capture you get so you can just pick any random video any video you see online or a video of yourself just upload it here and make sure you are using your pc to do this not your um, phone so select upload so i'm going to go to um, download i'm going to select this video i saw this video on tiktok so i'm going to be using this and let me select confirm so let's wait for it to analyze so this is row detection so let me see this. So you can decide to cut the video if you want. I want to see this. I think this is fine. So let me just um, select the uh, row detection. Yes. So when you select row detection, there is it's how do I put it? It focuses the. It shows. Um, it's focused on the character that you want to uh, motion capture in that um, video you get so that is what this um, role detection does so you see this um, shape on this um, person that is dancing in that video so that is where uh, you can see so this the motion of this particular person is going to be copied to the character so um, i'm going to be using mixamo you get mixamo um, output format so i'll select I'll drag you have to drag this example so when you select you drag it to the character and you see it's character one example and the next thing you press is um next step and you can just you can see you can rename it to anything you want let me just see um uh, dance uh let me see um let's name it tiktok tick talk um dance and you press generate now so video upload in progress so um the next thing we should do is to go and look for the character we're going to um target this motion capture to so um i'm going to use mixamo character so open your mixamo.com and um, i'm going to go to characters So I will just pick any character. So let me use this guy here, Remy. So Remy will be the one dancing for us. Um, Abi, should I make put? This? Uh, no. Okay, I think it's cool. Let's use James. James looks cool as a dancer. So I'll be using this person. I I'm even confused. I want to use someone for me. Let's use James. So I'm going to yes use this character. So this is james i'm going to download james yes tipos then the next place we are going to go to is blender so let's wait for it to download downloading assets so um it's downloading i think this should show something let me go back to quick magic so uh these are videos i've done with this um software you can see this so when i select this you see the video is being processed please wait so with that let us just go to blender open your blender i'm using blender 4.2 and i'm going to uh, open this i'm coming this is file this is um we we'll select import then i'm going to select fdx mm. So um let's go to download 
and um, let's look for Remy. I think I'm right here. Yeah, Remy, Remy should be here. Where's R? Uh, oh, it has not been done. Okay, it's still downloading. Sorry, slow network. Okay, we are done. So I think I have to reload that. Let me reload this. Yeah. I'll try again. File, import, FBX, download, and uh, I should find Remy here. I don't know why it's looking. Except the name is not Remy. Dance boy, dance one boy skin. Let me see. I think that's the name. Oh, the name is CHO6 non PBR. <sighs> okay. CH, oh, this is it. CH06 non PBR. Yeah, so imports. So let's wait for it to load. Yeah, so we have this character and uh, I'm coming. Let's see the texture. Okay. So I need to check back if the video has um, finished um, processing. Let me reload this. So I'm going to reload this page. Okay, so I think um, I think at least five minutes it was done with the whole uh, video um, processing. So let's select the TikTok dance. Let's see the result. Okay. I think this result is not bad so let's select download so let's it download uh, so um it's done download this 2.6 mb yeah so let me select this it's it's um compressed so i'm going to copy this copy the tiktok dance mix i and probably paste it somewhere or paste it on my on my download uh can just paste it out there yes so control v yeah tiktok dance mix and more so let's go back to blender and um i need to bring this in so i want to create a new collection so this is where i'll be bringing that one in so let me select uh import i'm selecting fbx and let's look for tiktok dance mix and more st okay, yeah this is it so tiktok dance mix and more let's input this entire so this is it yeah so um let's set the post to t post um i'm going to select this and i'm going to select rest position both are in t post you can see perfect so um <clears throat> the next thing you need is the um rococo add-on for retargeting so uh i will drop the link in the description um box so this is the rococo studio life yes so you can also use it for retargeting okay so let me i want to see the bone of this um character so there's a material one i'm at your one in front okay so um so let's deselect so what we'll do is to select retargeting our source is the animation or the motion capture we did so this is a material one yes and our target is the one we downloaded from mixamo i don't know if this is yes i'm actually one so what you do next is you select build bone list and after that select retarget animation sorry okay entries please use use the i'm coming please use each target bone only once left shoulder i'm coming let me example read left shoulder and example read right shoulder okay i have to go and look for this now so manual okay so the um the retarget animation is saying that we have double left shoulder and double right shoulder so we need to change one of these so i'm going to change this to the left arm yes so and um let's scroll down and look for the right okay right should be down so so this is the right arm so uh, i'm going to change this look for the exact example read right arm right arm so let me look for right arm uh, okay we have the right arm here you can see this so this is perfect no duplicate of a um, rig so um let me drag this in back and select 
with target animation. So we are done with targeting and this is the final result. You can see this. So what I'll do here is to hide this. I'll hide this one. Let me hide this. Uh, yep. Oh, not going to fully. Let me see. Okay, yes. And turn off the cameras. Yes. So you can see we have this. And if I pull this through. Um, come in. So let me select this. And um, I don't know how many frame. Let me put about. 1000 yes so that i can drag the slider more so okay this frame is about six i think this should be like six um 45 so okay so one more than that uh, you know 645 let me just put that 650 so so you can see this so um let me pull let me make this so this is it. So this is what we have here, and this is just how you can target animation with um you can create a motion capture with um quick magic AI and then we target it on Blender. So thank you for watching this tutorial. So I'm going to be dropping another tutorial again on quick magic AI, and this one will be using um the stereo character. We're going to be using Blender and we're going to be using Clo 3D. So I'm going to show you the workflow of how to do this thing using Quick Magic and using this other software so that you can have a perfect simulation with your clothes you get. So that's in case you want to do motion capture and you want to also allow your clothes to simulate, not like this one here, but a better realistic movement of your clothes. So see you in my next tutorial.